hides the whole thing. Now, I think a consequence of this is there'll be many groups in the early 2020s working on brain like a AGI architecture. It's artificial general intelligence. I think it's just a natural consequence of these things. If any of these groups has any significant success, they're going to be trying these things out on supercomputers pretty fast. It is inevitable, right? Um, and there should be exaflop supercomputers. So this is one with 18 zeros after it. And this is a conservative prediction. If you look at the supercomputer guys and what they're predicting and say a top 500 of org, they're predicting an exaflop by 2019. This is what they think is going to happen, right? We're already, um, we're already at uh, two petaflops. Um, 10 petaflops is coming in a year. And just, it's like six months after that, it's 20 petaflops. And IBM is already talking to, to groups about how to build the first exaflop machine. They're already discussing it with them based on the 20 petaflop machine, right? So this is, the idea that we're going to be here by the early 2020s, that's actually arriving late, okay? So I think that this is very reasonable. This is very reasonable. I mean, if, if these things are true, then this is very reasonable. This is certainly very reasonable. That is very reasonable. This is a question mark. Will we figure out the algorithms to get really powerful? I don't know. I suspect we might. But we're not going to have a practical theory of friendly AI. Now, I've spoken to a bunch of people, including um, <coughs> Michael Vassar, the president of Singularity Institute. None of them that I've ever spoken to think that they will have a practical theory of friendly artificial intelligence in about 10 years' time. No way. When I talk to them, they say, well, we're kind of bang we're, it's going to take longer than that. It's not going to be the 2020s before things start getting crazy. I'm arguing here, we are starting to understand. Uh, I'm not saying we understand, quote unquote, how the brain works. Because there will be a lot of things we won't understand how the brain works. But we're when we look at the brain, we're actually getting an architecture for the system. We know all these different bits how they connect up the basic algorithms that are being used. And in some cases, quite explicitly, the algorithms that are being used. So we, we actually have a blueprint for building an artificial general intelligence, and it's emerging quite quickly. And we're going to have the computer power to drive the thing. So that's my Halloween scenario. That in the early 2020s, we have, we're going to have the hardware, we're going to have the exaflop supercomputers, we're going to possibly have the deep belief networks. This is the questionable bit. This is the bit that could ruin, make or ruin the whole thing. Are we going to get a lot more? This is a hot area at the moment, by the way. A lot of people going into this. We just had a, a big uh, workshop with all the top people in the world at the Gatsby unit. Um, a lot of things happening here. This, this, is, this, is, this, this list looks like it's going to be solved well before then. Um, so if this all takes off, we're going to have people with brain-like AI architectures plugging their systems into exaflop supercomputers and we have no idea how to deal with consequences. And the, these, these systems to start with, maybe they're not that dangerous, maybe they're not going to take over the world or do anything crazy. <coughs> they're starting to converge on the types of algorithms that, lead, that we really should be worried about. But we don't know what they're going to do. And that, I will leave it there. You can't stop now. Got yeah, so, so what do we do about this? You're going to develop the searches from number two to number five, to number yeah. six, is that right? What can you do about this? You can't slow down this sort of thing. I mean, this is a massive global effort, right? Um, it's going to make the research on friendly AI more attractive. I don't think you can really speed it up much. It's really hard. When I say that, you know, they're not going to develop this, this is not a criticism of their ability or their intent or anything like this. It's really, really hard. We have no idea how to solve this problem. Is, I don't know if we can really speed it up. Is this AI is going to make it easier to solve, or is it going to make it harder? Or is it... I don't know. Let's talk about this in pub. I mean, really, if, <laughs> if you have alternatives to my Halloween scenario, then, then, then tell the world we'll do, about it. We'll them. do a version 